Hi, it's Terry Gaines. I want to share some samples I made using the Corner Bouquet stamp set, which is one of the exclusive stamp sets you can earn free with a qualifying order from Stampin' Up. Most of the samples I created, I used designer series paper that is in a packet called Flowers for Every Season. It is six by six paper, and there are 12 different double-sided designs. I used the back side of several of these beautiful floral prints. They coordinate with the in colors, and I use several of the different in colors along with some embellishments. The corner bouquet stamp set has two images that are floral corners, and for my samples, I did not use them in a corner, and I'll share how I use these um, in a different way. For the first sample I have here, I have stamped and then I punched out with a two inch circle punch and then I have the two and a quarter inch circle punch layered. The sentiments are from a stamp set called Frame For You and I use the everyday label punch kind of turned sideways to stamp that sentiment. And as I mentioned, the flowers for every season designer series paper. For this card, I use the stitched shapes dies which has circle ovals and square dies and embellished with ribbon and basic pearls. For this sample, I use the ornate layers dies, which um, really changed the shape of that image, along with the frame for you for the sentiment. And as I mentioned, a lot of the in color products. This has this just jade and I use the stitched nested dies for this sample. Here's a sample where I stamped in two different colors. I stamped with the bumblebee for the top part of the floral image, and then I stamped in the Just Jade ink pad. If you're going to do this technique, be sure to stamp the light color first and then the dark color. And right where the two blended together, I camouflaged with some ribbon. And the next two samples I have, I did not use the designer series paper. I stamped the papers to get a background. This has basic black and poppy parade along with the new matte embellishments. And the last sample I have is using the stacked stone background stamp to stamp this piece of paper or cardstock. And then I use the layering oval dies and the frame for you for the sentiment. So I have a variety of samples here. I hope you um, found them useful and can you are welcome to copy them. And thanks for stopping by. If you found me via YouTube, look in the comment section for a direct link to my blog post where you'll see photos of these card samples. I hope you enjoy stamping with the corner bouquet stamp set. Contact me if you have any questions. Stay safe and stay healthy.